From the Intellifluence headquarters in sunny Scottsdale, Arizona, this is the Intellifluence Influencer Spotlight. In each episode, we sit down with an influencer from our network and we discuss their background as well as their unique approach to influencer marketing. William John Titus Bishop was born in London and learned cello and double bass as a teenager after developing a keen interest in music, performing predominantly orchestral works. Later, he learned how to play the guitar. Having a background in literacy and poetry, he writes his own songs and music. Bishop recorded three full-length studio albums, each on guitar and piano. His breakthrough single was released in January 2021, receiving critical acclaim from musical journalists and airplay from national and international radio stations, as well as extensive mainstream media coverage. You can learn more at williamjohntitusbishop.com. William, thanks so much for joining us today. We really appreciate it. Um, I'd like to know um, about your background. Could you give us a brief introduction into how you got started in music? Oh, okay. Um, well, I started um, when I was very young. I started at school um, and I learned, um, I did a lot of music at school. I learned um, that from a very classical kind of um, a very classical sort of background with sort of cello and, and double bass and sort of very sort of um, very sort of uh, technical kind of um, scholastic stuff and very very uh, academic kind of music and mm-hmm. I learned that all the way through till I left school um, and when I finished school and um, I started studying at university. Um, I wanted to keep playing music, but I didn't want to necessarily play classical stuff anymore. Um, it wasn't. It was. It was great learning, and it was a fantastic thing to do growing up, and it was a great introduction to music. But I didn't want to um, pursue that. I wanted to do other other sorts of music. So I. Um, learned piano and guitar, and I started writing my own stuff, and took it from there. Want to join Intellifluence as an influencer? It's free, easy, and you get to keep 100% of your earnings. Go to Intellifluence.com, click or tap Influencers, then click or tap the Join for Free button. Once you have registered for free as an influencer, you can start creating offers with custom pricing and services. Brands can pitch you to work with them via these offers. Once you have created your offers, head over to the marketplace and browse opportunities for brands. Apply to any and all that are a great fit. Earn cash quickly by referring your friends and family. And, and then what do you consider to be your career breakthrough in terms of when, of when you said, you know, I'm I'm getting traction in this and you know I'm I'm you know people are people are connecting with my music. Um that's a really good question. Um if there it's very difficult to to pinpoint an exact moment or one thing that happened that sort of um that sort of set off other things in motion. It's very difficult to come to a um come to one sort of moment if you like but if anything comes to mind it is um uh, it was um when i was speaking to a um um i was speaking to a artist uh, and record car representative from one of the bigger record labels um who was and he was a executive at the, at the record company at the time. And um, I think it was Warner Brothers. And he, and I had a meeting with him, a one-to-one meeting. And I sat there with him and I played him a song. And I said to him, um, I said, to be absolutely honest, do you think I'll get a record company? Yeah. And I said, be absolutely honest, do you think I'll get a record company? And he said, not with us. But, Go for it. Just don't pursue this particular avenue. And it was from there that I thought, okay, so 
Um, maybe not this opportunity, but other opportunities I should go for. So it gave me the confidence to continue with what I was doing, but at the same time, it gave me a better sort of a more realistic idea of where I would maybe get to in the future. Absolutely. And then um, your social media platform um, has grown to over a million followers combined. Um, and so I'm interested in, um, in your approach to social media. Um, do you have a team? Do you manage everything on your own? And, you know, what's your favorite platform to communicate on? Oh, um, gosh. Um, both. I do a bit of both. I've worked with teams of people um, on occasion. Um, it tends to be around certain releases or around certain, or if there's a brand that I really love or a brand that I'm, I'm really kind of invested in myself and that I, mm -hmm. I have some sort of thing that I've been um, going through for years or I see a brand that I like and I want to work with, with them, then um, I will, there will be a, a team of people. Um, there will be kind of more than, um, you know, it won't just be myself. And, yeah, and on occasion I've had people actually, you know, actually design the content for me and then I've posted that. So it's been done very much with their guidance and with their kind of, um, because there are people out there that have much more experience and much more expertise than I do um, mm -hmm. in this sort of field. I mean, it's something that is, um, it's such a big, quite a new, to me, it's quite a new, a new thing, but and it's, there's so much going on there. and there are so many people involved in um, sort of influencing and influencing marketing and all that side of things and it's such a it's a great thing I think because it allows um, it brings up people's creativity and it allows sort of access to different audiences which is a great thing um, so I've done both really I've done I've done sort of I've worked with people who design these posts and this content in a very specific way um, and that's been successful and I've also done a lot of that myself um, and just sort of put stuff out on social media just 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 myself just of um of, of music and things like that and seeing how that has gone you know how, how people have interacted and how people have reacted to that and then um you know, and, and then, then you can make sort of changes. You can say, right, that's gone really well. Great, but, you know, sort of, you know, that's, that's attracted a lot of attention. Okay, I'll keep posting stuff like that. Or the opposite, you know, if, if, some, if you post something that's kind of doesn't, doesn't go anywhere, then you can, you can say, right, maybe be a little bit less of that next time. So it's, it's, it's a process really of finding out what works for you and then doing more of the same. And then finding out what doesn't work for you and not kind of doing it, I guess. And that evolves over time. And, um, then you find more and more people follow you. And if you keep at it, if you don't get disheartened and if you just, you know, mm -hmm. keep going, then, um, then you can, um, you can get a, a you know, a, a, a decent following. Absolutely. Absolutely. And, and on the topic of brand partnerships, what have been some of your favorites? I, I, I know uh, Urban Outfitters looks like a prominent one. Uh, what, what do you look for in a collaboration? I think the most important thing for me is that you are, it is something that you yourself are interested in and something that you yourself use. Because a brand are gonna tell, I think quite quickly, if you're not actually interested in what they do. But if you're interested yourself in what the brand are doing and it's something that you use and something you really like. I mean, I, with the, the Urban Outfitters, as an example, I do a lot of my clothing is from Urban Outfitters. It, it's something that, it's a, a retail chain that I've been going to for a number of years. And um, so it's something that I, you know, I, that those products I really do like. But, you know, it's something that I, um, you know, I, I do spend a lot of time with an outfit just looking at the clothes. And um, it was great when the opportunity arose because I could, um, you know, hopefully put some of that enthusiasm into their brand. And then that gives them a much more positive kind of um, 
you know, it makes them feel much more comfortable and much more positive about the collaboration. And, um, you know, that's that's going that's going well so far. That's been one of, that probably has been my my favourite so far because it's a brand that I'm, um, that I, you know, I'm quite close to myself. But um, a lot of, a lot of the collaborations have been with um, with clothing brands or, or fashion brands. Um, some uh, some sort of more independent brands in Europe um, who have been clothing brands again, um, who I've been happy to work with because um, they're sort of uh, smaller brands, but they're, they're doing something really unique, individual, and um, it helps them. Well, uh, broadening their sort of audience and, and sort of yeah. interest. So they've been the best ones, but there's been, um, just off the top of my head, maybe there's been a few uh, European sort of clothing, clothing brands, um, more independent ones, and my well, favourite so far is Urban Art, which is a really good one. Wonderful, wonderful. And then, and then what do you have on tap for 2024 in terms of, in terms of music, in terms of um, social media marketing? Yeah, let us know. Right. Well, um, <laughs> you, have to, um, you would have to to answer that fully. You would have to ask my my marketing team. Um, they give you a much better answer than me. But <laughs> um, but the, the, what I can what I can tell you is that um, music wise, there will be um, a new single and a new album out this spring um, around March time. That should be coming out. Um, on Sony Music's um, Owl label, and that will be coming out. Um, should be coming out beginning of March, um, and there'll be a single there. Lots of visual stuff, music videos, and lots of kind of um, lots of lots of uh, lots of images, and lots of lots of sort of lots of opportunities for content around that. Um, so that on the music side is. Um, so that should be happening um, early spring, and with the influencer, uh, the influencer side of things, um, I hope to work with as many brands as I can. Um, obviously, that I have some interest in, and that would like to work with me. You know, that 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 can see that that are interested in the music. You know, that you know my creative output, my music, would actually enhance their brand in some way. So, because, um, uh, you know, it's very easy, I think, to, to work with people who create content and have a, um, something like music, and then a brand comes to them expecting, and without mentioning what they're doing, musically. Um, you know, but that's only going to work if the brand thinks that the music is going to help with getting engagement, with getting um, attention for the brand. Um, if the brand likes the music and if the brand thinks that the music is going to help enhance their, their sort of brand awareness and their brand reputation, then that's the best sort of partnership because um, it's mutually beneficial. It helps get them, it helps from, from my end, it helps get the music out and it helps broaden the awareness of that. And from a brand's perspective, it, it does the same. Um, and, and the music sort of enhances what they're doing in a, in a, uh, in a sort of mutually beneficial way. That's the kind of, that's, those are the best ones. And um, hopefully more of those, and hopefully with some more. Uh, there are, some, there are some absolutely wonderful brands out there and there are some really lovely, lovely people um, who work very, very hard at these, um, with their products and with their designs and, and all of that stuff. And it's really nice to meet some of these people and to, and to work with them. So, um, as broad a range of people as possible, but um, as long as there's some sort of mutual interest, then uh, and that's, uh, I think that's a good way to go forward.
The IntelliFluence for Influencers app enables you to earn free products or cash in exchange for your honest reviews using your mobile device. Upon logging in, or signing up for free if you haven't already, you will arrive at your custom dashboard where you can view transactions that need your attention at a glance or browse our recommended offers from brands. Check out marketplace offers from brands and apply to your favorites. Once you accept a pitch from a brand, you can complete the entire transaction anywhere using your mobile device and communicate with the brand using our intuitive messaging tool. You will never have to go outside the app. View your earnings summary, including upcoming payments, as well as your entire history. You can view your influencer profile strength and make any necessary updates to your profile to put you in better position to be pitched. Edit your details, such as compensation preferences and social accounts with ease. If you could ever use some help, you can access the IntelliFluence knowledge base or contact support at any time from the app. As an influencer, there are never any fees associated with using our influencer marketing service, and you get to keep all of your earnings. Download the free IntelliFluence for Influencers app today and get started.